Welcome everybody to the Privacy Roundtables in Cannes. The matter of privacy has been haunting all of us uh, in the industry for uh, more than 10 years. We believe that we should not let the regulations put some restrictions on the consumer's right to choose. We matter to brands. They want to be proactive about working on this issue of privacy, giving consumers choice, giving consumers respect, using data in a way that's responsible. We share the same goal for the benefit of the European consumers and also for the businesses. I think we'll all agree in this room, user trust for any business is really paramount. And clearly privacy is an essential component of user trust. And that's why for us it's so important that together we can create an advertising world that is going to work for everyone and that will be trusted by people. People are looking for a more private way of communicating generally. It's messaging, it's stories. In reality, advertising and privacy can work very, very well together. GDPR is all about opting in and opting out. I accept, I accept, I accept, I accept. At some point that becomes notice fatigue, and we don't want that. They don't want that. That actually will lead to less trust. If you throw up a consent for everything, consent becomes absolutely meaningless. You have a promise with the consumer, uh, and uh, repeatedly fulfilling that promise is something that actually engenders trust. And a part of that is related to privacy, keeping the data safe. Trust actually stems from, in Rahul's world, being true to what you are, all right, and having an authentic and transparent relationship with consumers. There have been some incidents, uh, obviously. So Cambridge Analytica was, was, was an incident that you know, this, this really sparked more awareness uh, with, uh, with consumers. They're going to get away with what they can up to a point, and then if you think about any relationship, the relationship between a brand and a consumer, um, it's like the relationship between a husband and a wife. Once either some awareness takes place, you know, like I know there's some wrong happening, uh, then at that point you have to start making changes, and that comes to like the rebuilding process.